If you're looking at low cost portable solar power options, then you're gonna to wanna to take a look at the brand new EcoFlow River 2. It's one of the lowest cost all-in-one solar portable generator solutions incorporating lithium iron phosphate chemistry, AC and DC charging, and a pure sine wave inverter. Hi everyone, Joe Ordia here for Solar Surge, and for the past nine years, I've been helping families achieve energy independence using clean, renewable energy. Uh, if you're new to the Solar Surge channel, on Solar Surge, we talk about all things having to do with home solar power systems, uh, battery storage systems, and sometimes even generator backup systems as well. Now, recently we've begun covering a new category of product, which is portable all-in-one solar generators. And I'm excited to be bringing to you today one of the lowest cost all-in-one solar generators available, the brand new EcoFlow River 2. All right, let's take a look at what comes in the box. Okay, got our inner packaging here. And here you can see the, the box here for the River 2. We just open the seal. All right, just got some packing material here. Um, instruction manual. And here is the River 2. I'll turn it here so, so you all can see it. So obviously much, much smaller than the Delta 2 unit that we reviewed last time. Everything is here on the front. You've got your uh, high voltage AC outlets, uh, your USB-A, USB-C, your control panel, and your 12 volt cigarette lighter adapter. And then it looks like we have our charging cables here, uh, both the AC, charging cable uh, and as well we have our 12 volt uh, DC charging adapter uh, as well. Now when we talk about a solar generator basically what we mean is you're taking the battery storage, the DC to AC inversion and the charge controlling and integrating it into one portable appliance. Now in the old days if you were building an off-grid solar power system Generally, you'd have your bank of batteries, that'd be one component. Then you'd have large cables connecting your batteries to the inverter, which is what would pull DC power off your batteries and provide high voltage AC power to your appliance loads. Uh, you'd also have a solar charge controller generally sitting between the solar panels outside and the battery storage to make sure that the batteries aren't charging too fast or the batteries aren't overheating. And so it could become a very, very cumbersome installation, especially if you're looking for something large enough scale that you could power an entire building or you know, maybe an off-grid hunting cabin, something of that sort. But more recently, what we've seen coming online is portable solar generators that basically integrate all three of those functions and they do it in a smaller, more portable form factor. Uh, the main application for these is gonna be powering your portable electronics. Uh, that could be for recreational purposes, whether you're, maybe you're going hunting, uh, camping, uh, that sort of thing, uh, or for emergency backup purposes for your home. And so today we're going to be looking specifically at the brand new EcoFlow River 2, which is kind of the, 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 starter, the starter model on the portable generator line. Now, with the River 2, this unit can sustain a load of 300 watts continuous power, with up to 600 watt surge power. So uh, again, guys, this is really designed more for portable electronics, although I am gonna test some larger loads just to see what happens. Uh, I might try the chest freezer on this, maybe the uh, uh, ice maker, maybe even, maybe even the water pump, just to see how it handles with some of those heavier loads. But I think what you really wanna plan on using something like this for is gonna be charging for your portable electronics, whether you have a smartphone, a tablet, a laptop, uh, or you might have a, a small portable or a dormitory size uh, refrigerator, you could power it on this unit as well. 
Now, in terms of storage capacity, the River 2 has a 256 watt hour battery. So basically it's, it's a quarter of a kilowatt hour in terms of battery storage. So again, guys, not designed to power large loads, uh, even a refrigerator or something like that. It's not really designed to power anything like that for any prolonged period of time. But if you just need a way that you can charge your cell phone, your flashlight, uh, your radio, uh, then something like this is gonna be, gonna be fine for that. I believe you could charge your, your cell phone over 100 times just looking at the uh, battery capacities of each. So something like that would work. Now, the other nice thing about this unit is that it allows you to charge from multiple different power sources. Uh, the first one you all are probably going to be interested in is, is the solar power. However, you can also take advantage of just about any other power source that's available, including a 120 volt wall outlet. So the unit does come with a 120 volt charging cable. Where you can just plug into a wall outlet and charge that way. Uh, it also comes with a 12 volt cigarette lighter adapter. So if you have a vehicle power source, you can plug in, you can charge the battery that way. And then of course, through solar. All right, so now we're in the load testing part of the evaluation here. Uh, and as you guys know, one of the loads that I like to test out on my uh, off-grid solar power equipment is my ice maker machine. Now, we actually got a lot of inquiries in on the last EcoFlow video about where they can purchase. So I will go ahead and post a link down there again uh, if you're interested in purchasing one of these for yourselves to have. But guys, the, the reason I have an ice maker is because you know, again, if we're talking about a grid down uh, emergency situation, uh, if I'm one of the few homes in, in the neighborhood that has power and most of my neighbors don't have power, uh, I want to be able to make ice so that let's say all that they have is a cooler, at least I can provide some ice for my neighbors to use in their cooler so that they can keep food from going bad. Or for many folks, uh, especially folks that are uh, senior citizens, um, they have medications. Like for example, if you're, you're a diabetic, you have insulin that needs to be refrigerated so it doesn't go bad. So I like having the ice maker so at least I can provide something to my neighbors uh, if there's a grid down emergency and I'm one of the few homes here that have power. Now, this particular model, as you might recall from the last video, has a 450 watt compressor when it's running at max load. Uh, now, the River 2 officially has a 300 watt continuous power rating with a surge power up to 600 watts. So I'm gonna be very, very interested to see if the River 2 can actually handle the ice maker uh, and handle it for a uh, prolonged period of time as we make a couple of batches of ice. So let's give it a shot here. All right, now the River 2 is showing 30% battery state of charge. This is exactly how the uh, Delta 2 came out of the box, 30% charge from the factory. And what we're gonna do is fire up the ice maker. First of all, make sure that we can get the compressor fired up and then let it run for some time and uh, just see how long the battery holds up under load from the compressor. So let's fire it up here. Well, I think that answers the question for you. I got an overload message here on the River 2 and it went ahead and just cut power off to the loads. So again guys, uh, the River 2 is the most portable solution as far as what EcoFlow provides. It's not designed for heavy load, high power appliances. This unit here, it really is designed for just keeping your portable electronics, uh, giving you a way that you can recharge those portable electronics uh, during a blackout or if you're, you're off the grid and away from utility power. Well, folks, this has been a brief introduction to the new EcoFlow River 2 portable solar generator. Um, as always, if you're getting good value from the content that we post on Solar Surge, be sure to give us a thumbs up uh, and also consider subscribing to the channel if you haven't done so already. Uh, that way, as we publish the new videos, whether they be new product releases, reviews, head-to-head -head comparisons, uh, it'll help you keep up with us so that you don't miss anything. 
Uh, of course, if you are in the market for a portable solar generator, I believe EcoFlow is running a promotion on the River 2 right now. I believe you can get one for under, uh, under $500. Uh, but check check the link down below in the description uh, if you'd like. I think it gives you a 5% discount off the normal price. Well, folks, as always, I thank you for taking some time to chat with Solar Surge today. I'm Joe Ordia here, as always, encouraging you to get prepared and be empowered. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next video.